Hello everybody, this is Alice the Dragon, here again with Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Um, had a little bit of an adventure uh, with uh, trying to get the sound, so hopefully you can hear it now. And while I was uh, using a new batch of recording software, well, um, hmm. Let's, let's just say that uh, it was unusable. <laughs> I just couldn't use it. Uh, but uh, now I've got it working, so hopefully uh, you can join me for, you know, for this uh, new thing. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to do Willow this time. Regular Don't Starve or Reign of Giants? Yeah, just regular. Alright, let's do this. Generating world! Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to mention that while I was trying to record, <laughs> uh, I also died as Wilson, so that's why you, that's why you missed that. That's why there's an empty slot in my saves. I probably should clear out some of those other ones, but really, am I gonna do more than one run at a time at this? I don't think so. One way or another, I just, I just want to have fun. Yeah, I keep saying that uh, I'm doing this for me, but I really do enjoy having you come along with me. Yes, let's get started with sticks. Get those sticks. Get those twigs. After I'm done recording here, I'm gonna take Bella out for a walk because poor thing had an upset tummy today. She made a big old mess on the floor. And that is entirely because she got into the garbage while my mate was uh, clearing out the fridge. So, yeah, Bella, you brought it on yourself. <laughs> She's just lying down there and uh, doesn't really care that I'm talking into nothingness again. But, uh, yeah, it's quite nice. Uh, here in the uh, Pacific Northwest, there's a gaming convention that uh, I went to today called NorwestCon. And I went there because uh, some, uh, some friends uh, that I LARP with at the Alliance Seattle live-action role-playing game. I highly recommend you try Alliance if you have... If you've LARPed, if you've never LARPed, um, it's just so much fun. And you can just show up and play an NPC for free. So, yeah, that's good stuff. Uh, so I took a bunch of flyers that we printed out and folded and took them over and that was nice. I uh, checked out some of the vendors. I, I, I wouldn't say I get super excited about conventions. I've been to three if you count Lebowski Fest. I've been to the Star Trek convention. I went to this one, Norwest Con. I was really hoping we would find some beefalo there. I'm half tempted to just run back this way and see what's see what's what. Oh yeah, that's another area. I don't have any flint yet. And that may be a problem. Do 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 yeah, and still no sign of beefalo. I think I'm just gonna wander around until I find beefalo. Or some other... Ooh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is that... Is that a rock biome? Because if it's a rock biome, there's gold! Gold! And maybe flint? Hello, tall bird. More gold. Yeah, gold doesn't really help if I don't have 
split. <laughs> uh, don't even have wood yet. Where's all the flint? Like, this is going to get bad if I can't find some flint. Okay, where's it at? Where's it at? Just keep going this way. Bees! One thing that I've actually not done in Don't Starve is uh, get a beehive. I think I get carrots, why not? I guess I could save them for later, but at this point I'm just going around getting everything. Uh, I need to find a place to camp. There's more berries, more berries. Berries are good. Let's see. Blue mushroom. Uh, no flint, no flint. Where's my flint? Flint, 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 flint. Another flint. I saw it. Down there. Mm. Yeah, things things have been kind of rocky on on my side of the mountains, um, but I'm taking care of myself and yeah, I'm doing my pot and my uh, let's plays, which are fun. <laughs> oh, yeah. How how can they not be fun? They're liter it's literally playing a game while people watch. Okay, I think I've got plenty of that straw. Kinda hoping to get some more flint and maybe make a pickaxe. Uh, it's getting dark. It's getting there. How about I just set up next to this wormhole or or go back to uh I won't have enough time to go all the way back to the rocks. Okay then. Get a campfire going. Cook up our carrots. Yum yum yum. Funny thing, I don't like cooked carrots. I prefer raw carrots. And, uh, and the opposite is true with tomatoes. I don't like raw tomatoes. I like cooked tomatoes. Yeah. Taste can be interesting like that. I think with the carrots is the, is the crunch factor. Because for me, if you don't have the crunch factor, that's like half of, you know, half of the joy of eating a carrot, especially if you get one of those really, really big ones where you can kind of gnaw off that outer, I want to say, like, it's not really a coating, but like the outer meat, <laughs> carrot meat, <laughs> and it's around this really nice kind of sweet core and uh, and I like to you know, nibble off the outside bit and uh, and, <laughs> and then I have just the, the sweet uh, carrot core which is nice if you've never tried that with a raw carrot it's kind of fun like not all not all carrots will be able to do it Sometimes you just have to, like, just nibble, nibble, nibble until it starts coming apart. I don't know if there's any really big difference between carrot species on how easy it is to um, get that core out. But, uh, eh, that's, 
Not really something I'm interested in studying. <laughs> Ooh, well, hello. Seems to me like we have found a pretty decent place to set up camp. I'd like to see where that wormhole goes. Because if that wormhole goes someplace nice, then we are set. Especially if there are beefalo nearby. One thing I should probably start doing as, uh, yeah, as a, a you know, well, in Dead Star, is uh, I should probably just set up a variety of camps and just have, um, you know, the fire pits all over the place so that if I'm traveling, yeah, I, you know, might stop at, you know, pit stop, essentially. So, uh, yeah, that's something to think about. I've also been thinking of what other games I would like to play on this channel, and, um, there's actually... Oh, there's a piece of flint right there, and I didn't know. Ah, leave me alone, tall bird! Leave me alone! I am not going after your babies. There we go. This is what I was looking for. Uh, where was I? I have no idea. I, f I forget stuff way too much. Oh well. It's not like it was that big of a deal. Uh, let's see. I want to definitely set up a science station somewhere. I want to get more of these, of these rocks. More gold, always. Let's see. Any other places I can go from here? Just to check that out. Let's see. We've got rocks. We've got niter. Which I don't see why we would need niter yet. It almost seems like we're either in you know, early spring or late fall, just given the uh, yeah, you know, this thing up up in the upper right corner of uh, you know the clock, and the, and the fact that the orange bits are so big. It almost seems like it lost one since last night. So maybe we're in spring. If that's the case, that's really good for us. Because we won't have to wait nearly as... Well, we won't have to deal with winter near, nearly as, as early. Do, 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 do. Always gotta get more stuff. Oh, oh okay. Well, uh... Let's uh, just make some room in our uh, inventory. One more. Yeah, there you go. Scare the crow. Ha <laughs> ha uh. Oh yeah! One thing that I mentioned in my failed recording that I haven't mentioned here yet, um, so the other day, I uh, yeah I woke up and uh, I'm like I'm gonna upload one of my videos, and uh, I go to DTube because I post to DTube first, and there on the front page is a video that says "Don't starve," and I look and it, it's it's my video. And, and, uh, <laughs> and, you know, it was like in the hot and trending section. <laughs> and not only that, um, there, there was like, you know, 50 bucks worth of, uh, Steam monies on there. So, oh my god, I was so happy. <laughs> so, I actually do have a chance. I, I actually have, am trending. There we go. I, I can talk. I swear I can talk. Just gotta give me a chance. Okay. Both our tools broke. 
we have way too much gold. We're kind of far from that wormhole we wanted to explore. Uh, let's just keep going for a little bit. And we can always plop down a, a fire when we when we get there. Oh, there's the ring thing. I still have no idea what the what you're supposed to do with the ring thing. So I'll just remember where that is for now. Doesn't show up on the map, but Hey, 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 hey. Another thing I would really like to find is Chester. If I can find Chester, that would be great. Uh, I've also decided uh, to do this unmodded. Uh, even though I love mods, especially when I'm playing Minecraft. I can't play Minecraft without mods. <laughs> like, I was really into it back when it was uh, in alpha testing. And, yeah, as the... Haha! <laughs> uh, as the modding community started building up, like, there's just so many great things that you can add to your Minecraft experience. Yeah. Okay. So I think what we should do is in the morning we should just um, head on back up to to here with that wormhole. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow this coastline and see where it takes me. <coughs> Excuse me. I cough. I hope that wasn't too loud for you. If if not, I can adjust it in the in the audio uh, settings thing, you know. <laughs> uh, I think that you know when I go to the con tomorrow, I'm going to uh, dress up in full garb and. Um, that basically means that I'm going to wear most of my um, costume that I wear to Alliance games. So that'll be fun. I hope that, uh, yeah, I hope that people uh, are interested in Alliance and uh, are picking up all those pamphlets that we put together the other, the other day. Because, uh, I, like, the thing about LARPers, LARPers always want to make more LARPers. <laughs> if you show up to a LARP and you know nothing, more often than not, like, every time in my experience, they, they've just been like, Yeah! Come in! There! Let me show you the ropes! Oh, we're so excited that a new person is here! <laughs> and it's just... mole up there in the corner. Okay, we were gonna follow this. I want to tell you a story about, you know, when I was in college and I was helping run a, a LARP that was a World of Darkness. So, um, you know, creepiness, magic, stuff like that. And uh, we were playing uh, Mage the Awakening, and uh, my mom came to visit. And I'm just like, Mom, you should to you're, you're gonna be here for the weekend. Our game is on Saturday. You should totally join us for that. By the way, hi, Mom. I know you watch this. <laughs> uh, and uh, so. We, we set her up with a bunch of magic items and we tell her, okay, we want you to go in as a merchant. You can, you can pick your own name, you can pick your own backstory, 
but all you got to do is go in and sell these items. And uh, she picked the name La Belle, and 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 like they all just had so much fun going to her little curio shop. <laughs> and you know, when everything was said and done, you know, she told me, you know, after after all that, it was it was just like. Um, she had a chance to... Ooh, here's another wormhole. I want to see where this one goes. Tell you! <laughs> yeah, the really nice thing about LARPing... Oh, that's exactly where it goes to. Okay, then. Well, uh... That's not great. It's not bad, either. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep looking. I should keep looking. I, will, I want to find a place that I can set up, preferably with beefalo within walking distance. That could be getting close. Let's see. Yeah, the, the really nice thing about LARPing yeah, and, uh, and my mom would attest to this, is that uh, it gives you practice at being social. It, like, it is literally social practice. And um, yeah, you can go into the game saying, I want, I don't know, I feel like I tend to be cowardly. So I want to... Oh, hello, Bella. Do you want to say hi to you know, the ladies and gentlemen and various animals that are watching this? Yeah? You good girl. Yes. <laughs> it, like, okay, so LARPing is social practice because you can, you can go, Hey, I'm going to you know, play this character who is super brave because I'm not brave. <laughs> And I want to practice being brave. And it works. Dang it, still no beefalo. Ah, I'm, I'm sad. I'm sad, Bella. I can't find a beefalo. Yes. She's literally just standing there with her nose in my face. Yes, I love you too. Yes, I love you too. I don't know if you can hear her. But, uh, yeah. She's, she's just being a cutie. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Could this be, maybe? Oh. Oh, what, what are those called? They're like walrus huts or something like that. That big old circle on the ground you saw. Oh, we found Wilson's door. We found Wilson's door. Oh, my God. Okay, so let's not be near where those spiders are. Is it over here all right? Yeah. Oh, I'm still carrying a piece of flint. All right. All right, just eat all the rest of these berries. There we go. Weird noises in the background. Okay, well, I guess this is turning into an adventure run. So, that'll be fun. Alright, I really want to plant a bunch of trees here that I can turn into ash and charcoal later. Alright. Run, 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 run! Ash. Honestly, this is probably the best place for Willow anyway. There isn't anything flammable nearby. 
Uh, let's see. We should get a science machine going. Let's put it right there. All right. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking with gas. Okay. I'm gonna need a shovel eventually. Alright. So. Make one of each of these. My, uh, my mental stuff went way up with that. Uh, Alright, uh, drop the nit niter, nitrate. <laughs> drop most of the gold. Alright, now what are we doing? <clears throat> we can make structures. We don't have enough logs to make the chest. We can make a spear. Don't have enough for a log suit. Darts. Alright. Let's do an electrical doodad. And, uh. Let's see. Don't I need to. Alright. Another electrical doodad. Alchemy engine. It's gonna need quite a bit more. So. Right. It's gonna. We're gonna need to get a whole bunch of those um, logs. Lots and lots of logs. That's what we need. Luckily, we have a whole bunch right here. I'd kind of like to get... Oh. Don't pick up the evil petals. Please don't. Alright, put that there. Some more trees. Once I get, um, okay, 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 stop, quit your complaining, Lulu. Yeah, once I, once I get something going here, preferably a farm, are there any beefalo? This place is certainly big enough to house them. Do, 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 do. Any beefalo? Anywhere? Hmm. I am not interested in chasing down rabbits right now. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Except for not swimming. <laughs> Mmm, still no beefalo. Ah. Uh, very tempted to just go jump in that portal right now, although I'm pretty sure we're getting close to end of episode time. Over here, maybe? Beefalo! Beefalo, 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 beefalo. Lots and lots of uh, savannah. That's nice. That is nice, but where's the beefalo? I just want to find a source of manure. Uh, come on. There's gotta be... They gotta be somewhere. They can't just be nowhere. Okay. 
eat some berries. Another thing I can do now that I have a shovel is I can go back and um, work. <clears throat> I could go back and uh, get a bunch of berry bushes, but I can't revive them until I have um, manure, which so far we haven't found anything that would give us anything like that. Uh, I think when I stop to camp for the night, I will, uh, uh, I'll, I'll just, uh, call it there. I still want to find the beefalo. They gotta be here somewhere. So give me a home where the beefalo roam. No, no sign of them. Ah, uh, this is uh, uh, this is slightly annoying because there's just so much of it, and there's been no sign of of them anywhere. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, I should just head back. I can do more exploring later. I'll go go back to oops. Right. Well, left in this case, but <laughs> that's where the coast is. So let's just head back as fast as our little legs can carry us. Also gives us a chance to kind of explore some new territory. Yeah. Okay then. Well, gee Wilkers. Alright. Uh, we need lots more wood. Lots and lots more wood. Oh, that must have been one of the old trees. Oh. Oh. These trees are looking pretty good. Stay away from me. I do not want to play spider. One thing we can do, just to deal with spiders. Come here, spider. Come here. Come here. Come on. Yeah. Come this way. Come on. Come on. I dare you. I dare you. Ha! Alright. I know. Doesn't taste too good. Anyway, this is a good place to stop, so I will see you in the next episode. Bye! Don't pick your ear, Willow. Bye!